A small community in Lackawanna County is taking a new approach to fighting blight. As Eyewitness News reporter Eric Dable tells us now, Mayfield is joining the Lackawanna County Land Bank program to help cut down its number of rundown property issues. The borough of Mayfield is only home to about 1,800 people. It's a quiet community outside of Carbondale, but one that suffers from blight like almost every place else. We want to have every property as nice as it can be so that people enjoy living in the area. The mayor and council members joined Lackawanna County leaders Wednesday morning as Mayfield became the third municipality to join the county's land bank program. The borough has already identified two properties which could get help. The owner of this property in the 600 block of Penn Avenue recently died and back taxes are due. We're hoping that we're going to be able to either recover the home or at least uh, get uh, the funding to demolish it. Another property on Depew Avenue was the scene of an arson several years ago. It takes one property on a beautiful block to make it blighted. So we're going to try to take care of any issues that the mayor and council have. Borough leaders say it could cost between fifteen and twenty thousand dollars to take down just one blighted property. And that is money they just don't have. Mayfield leaders hope by joining the land bank, they can be more proactive as well, working with property owners before problems become too difficult to solve. We are small, but if you've been paying attention to what's going on around us, we are actually a community on the move forward. Moving forward, going from blight to bright. In Mayfield, Eric Dable, Eyewitness News. The Lackawanna County Land Bank program has already helped to return 81 properties in Scranton to the tax rolls. It is also working with Fell Township to demolish an old blighted school building.